we take the app and we click it on for, for right now I'm going to just run it for one minute and there you go hey everybody lazy gardener here um, one of the questions I get asked the most um, about my stuff is what are those white pipes in your boxes is that watering and the answer is yes that's my watering system let me show it to you so um, these are made out of PVC pipes and they click into place and they're used they use these quick connects to connect I use them to connect to each spigot each box or each zone really has its own um, spigot or water supply I'll show you that in a second and, and that's probably the biggest barrier to doing something like this but these I was able to do with regular hoses with on timers before I did this and I'll show you something uh, like that up there that you can run on timers but the PVC pipe um, in, in this case is only a certain length and the holes are a certain space apart if you can see the holes here um, based on how much water pressure you can push through here okay so each zone is controlled by a an electronic valve like this and this part of my garden was professionally uh, professionally run by an irrigation company because there's um, 40 zones on this system but again I'm going to show you right next how you can just run this off a regular uh, hose spigot and some timers so my system runs off of uh, uh, some hardware in the house and it was run in by an irrigation company and it runs very similar basically adapted actually a lawn sprinkler system um, in terms of being able to run it all off the phone this is how you would be able to run it um, just using uh, a hose timer and you can just put four timers on here and run it or you could do a series of these there are various units on the market that would allow you to kind of create an ad hoc watering system but for me the real uh, key is these PVC pipes okay so this is where everything comes into the house and into these three units these units are sold by a company called Sprinkle it's S P R I N K L not sponsored here but um, it's very simple to wire and if you have an irrigation system you can convert the units to this to run off your phone um, but again I've kind of taken this and I've repurposed it for a garden and each one of these can handle up to 16 zones. Some of the great features of these is first of all they're portable. They just come right out and you can work the soil and you put them right back in. They're very customizable. These pieces are not glued in. You can easily um, change the length, move them, put them in different boxes. You can do these in different configurations and uh, they just stay here all year round. The uh, PVC almost never appears to degrade. So you want to see it in action? Let's click it in. Okay, and now we get out phone program. We switch to the set of zones. We're here in the lower orchard. We then pick the zone we want to. In this case, I'm doing a manual run, but of course you can do scheduling. And press, and off we go. All right, let's turn that off. All right, up here is just, uh, just wanted to use this as an example to show you a different configuration and what it looks like when the plants are growing in it. I don't know if you can catch underneath the tomatoes, but it looks similar under there. And, and here, because we had the pavers, I couldn't get the piping run under it. I just had the spigots put uh, right there next to the house and I run these off of hoses. Let me show you the last thing in the greenhouse. So I brought you in the greenhouse so you can see a, another different configuration. And this one here, there's actually, uh, because the pressure is not strong enough to run both sides of the greenhouse, um, I have both of these running off, a, I have two, two zones running off a signal circuit. You have here, you can put these, I put these little valves on here, and by turning that one there, and I open the flow, then I can turn this one off here and block the flow, and then when I turn on the water, it's going to go over here. So that's my watering system. I hope you found it useful. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, leave a comment below if you have any questions. I have some other videos here, here, and you can subscribe here.
good luck and good garden.